There you go. Bomb. This picture's bomb. <laughs>来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来了，来
Okay, so this is me at the holiday fashion show. Because we had to walk in groups, so I walked with my one classmate. She was wearing gold, so we wanted to match. Oh my god, look at my face. I look lost. Oh, here's me with flowers. I wore like flower earrings. And then I wore the same shoes that I wore for the fairy costume. Oh god. <laughs> Here's me on stage. I look so awkward. I look, I look like a doll though. I had to get an escort because it was like for the formal segment and then they had like people from JRTC or like, I don't, I'm pretty sure JRTC or no, Mr. Red Hawk contestants or something to escort us. And so here's a video of me in that floral dress. So blurry. Oh. Oh my god, who recorded this? This sucks. <laughs> oh, there you go. Now you want to go in focus. I was like, walk with me because you're wearing purple and it matches my dress. <laughs> so I also wore that dress in my spring fashion show. I think it was called Fashion Pulse. I don't know who made up with these names. We had to vote for the names for the fashion show names. Ugh, I can't believe that like the ones that I didn't pick win. Crazy. So I made this two piece i was so into two pieces like matching ones so i made this turtleneck kind of black long sleeve with this black matching skater skirt pretty mediocre i know so here's me in the black not cute i think those are my sister's shoes or a lipstick with it here's me walking who recorded these <laughs> so blurry oh, i hate myself Mm -hmm. Oh, I miss that. I miss fashion shows. Yeah, and I miss high school. This one was for the everyday segment. The black one was for like the black and white segment, I think it was called. This one's for the everyday one. Another matching set. I made like this white tank crop and then these shorts with like the things on the sides. White shorts. Mediocre also. Not gonna lie. But here's me. This was 2014. My hair was so long. Look at my rosy cheeks, girl. But yeah, I just wore some white vans with it. Oh, they're dirty. And here's me walking. Whoever was recording this, man. Oh, girl. Look at your hair bouncing. I'm so cute. <laughs> Tom said, yeah, girl. Here's the finale. I wore the same thing. Oh, the girl. <laughs> oh, I'm funny. Oh, here's me and my baby. Look how cute he looks. Sorry, not the point of the video. Not the point of the video. This is 2014. We're not even a year yet. Look how cute he looks. Okay, so moving on to my senior year for my holiday show. Oh, this is one of my favorites that I ever made. I made this prom dress looking thing, like a two piece. I was so into two pieces. I made this cropped off white shirt with this matching tool skirt and had like some detail, some pearly details on it. I worked so hard on this, I cried. <laughs> I would work on my garments so last minute and then like the day the day before I'm still like trying to finish it up and stuff. I would like cry out of stress. <laughs> that was like one of the main reasons I didn't want to pursue fashion. I just I just found it so stressful to sew things. It was a good feeling to see the end product, but I just didn't like going through sewing and stuff. But it was a good experience. So this is the front look on me. And then I wore some nude Steve Madden strapless I mean strapless strappy heels and this is the back oh cute but yeah that was a holiday show i also wore that to the spring fashion show for the prom and evening segment it's me walking i was walking ahead of him he was walking a little too slow there <laughs> Girl. ew why was i posing like that i didn't even pose for too long Like bye, see ya. So our spring fashion show is called All About. It's all about fashion, pretty sure. And then for the everyday segment, I I made another two piece. <laughs> this maroon shirt with these maroon shorts. That it looks like a skirt. It's pretty short, but it's shorts. Let's see the video and pictures. So this one was for the everyday segment. It had like cutouts on the shoulders, or some the same black heels and then the black hat 
<sighs> Wait till you guys see the video. <sighs> this is the most embarrassing one. <laughs> so here's me walking. It's still looking cute as always. Oh, what the hell is that, Zoro? I like almost tripped. You can't really see it, but it's whatever. My last garment, my favorite. I think this is my favorite. This is the one I'm wearing right now. It's this white lace shirt. And then I made this matching white skirt with it. It was an A-line shirt, meaning it was longer in the back, shirt in the front. Then I have a bunch of stains on it. <laughs> so let me show you guys. I wore this for the wedding segment. Here's me and my baby. Me looking like I hate my baby. So here's me walking. I wore, for the wedding, I had like a bouquet of flowers with matching head thing and then it had the tool in the back. Oh, look how cute I look. Oh. No, I didn't have the tool in the back. I didn't have that. So that fashion show was in April. I graduated in June, but in May, I don't know if some of you guys are Filipino. So I did the Santa, Cru Santa Cruz on, and I was Lorena and Elena, which means I was, I don't know what that means, honestly. Let me look it up. The ritual pageant held on the day of the Flores de Mayo. I honestly don't know anything. Let's go to Wikipedia. It honors the finding of the true cross by Lorena and Elena and Constantine the Great. My little cousin, um, Adrian, was Constantine, I'm pretty sure. So I wore this top and then, cause you have to wear like a white gown. So I wore this white top and I had to make it like a long dress. So I made the same skirt, but I made it way longer. I'll just show you guys a picture of it. I made it way longer. There you go, bomb, picture's bomb. I have to wear like the crown. I'm not wearing the satchel in here, but look how long I made it. Look at me, there's a satchel and the crown. Here you go, I had to carry that cross and mine was Raina Elena 2015. That is me and Bebe. Bebe was my escort. There is my sister. I think I'm pretty sure that was my sister or my mom holding my dress. And then I had to memorize, not memorize, I had to read in Filipino, Tagalog, this whole like speech thing. And I wanted to memorize it, but I couldn't. I can understand Tagalog. I could read it also, but I'm not very fluent. So I had to read it in Tagalog in front of all these people at church. And there you go. There's me and Bebe. My sister holding my dress. And then Aiden was a Constantine little cousin. We had to walk around the church parking lot. It used to be way bigger back in the day, but we just had to walk in the church parking lot. So the last thing I wanted to show you guys, since I graduated 2015 and I didn't pursue fashion, this is my cat. It says, the world is your runway. 15, since I graduated 2015, had some flowers on the sides. And then I had like this measuring tape bow in the back. So cute. So those are my high school fashion designs. I hope you guys enjoyed this video liked the videos that I showed you guys pretty embarrassing from the start you can tell how bad I was or how I had like no taste but then gradually senior year my taste got better At the end of that chapter my fashion chapter I still love fashion buying clothes and all that stuff and styling my clothes on me making clothes wasn't for me I was good at it but I didn't want to pursue it for some reason I just didn't have the passion for it you know but if you guys enjoyed this video, give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below what you guys want to see next. If you guys want to see any more kinds of videos like this one, make sure to subscribe to my channel and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!